what's up guys so today we got a little bit of a different video for you we're in my room at my desk and we're going to be showing you guys how to set up turtle mode on the pavo let's get right into it so today i wanted to get some flying in but it was a little bit too windy out so i couldn't do that so i was like i kind of want to mess with my drone and try and figure out how to turn on turtle mode because i haven't had time to play with it and I go to look online and there's like no information on how to turn on turtle mode on the on the Pavo. So I figured it out and we'll show you guys. It's really simple. You just got to change a couple things in beta flight and then we'll show you guys how it actually works. But let's come over to the computer. All right, so we got the Pavo all hooked up to beta flight. And what you guys are gonna wanna do is head down to the receiver tab in beta flight or no, not receiver, modes. And then what I did was I took angle mode out of the quad, because who needs angle mode? And I had angle mode on aux one. And then you want to go down here and this flip over after crash, I just changed that to aux one. And then I slid the bar to where it was for angle mode before. So I basically just replaced angle mode with the flip over after crash function. So when I, on my DJI remote, when I click up, well, that's really dark. When I click up like this, it'll be in the flip over after crash mode. So then you guys are gonna wanna hit save on beta flight. Simple, save everything. Make sure you got flip over after crash set up to a button. And then you're gonna wanna disconnect from beta flight. I'll show you guys how to actually make it work. All right, so now that you guys have flip over after crash assigned to a button on your remote, let's test it out. So let's throw, I'm gonna throw just a little 2S battery in the drone and I'll plug it in on the floor and show you guys how it works. All right, so we got the Pavo 20 on the floor. We got the remote linked up to it. You guys see everything's working. We get the lights on, we get the beeper and this is the button Oh, focus, come on, come on. All right, but this is the button that I set. So when it's in this position, it's in the flip over after crash mode. When it's in this position, it's in horizon mode. And then when it's in this position, it's in acro mode. So, I mean, right now you see the drones right side up, put it in horizon mode, it'll take off like normal. And put it right back down. But if we flip it over, upside down we turn from horizon mode into flip over after crash and then we arm the drone it's not going to do anything but if you give it a roll it'll flip right over so let's show you guys that again so we'll turn that off put it back in horizon mode flip it over like we crashed put it in flip over after crash arm up the drone and give it a roll there we go. Let's show you guys that one more time. So you're gonna put it in flip over after crash. You're gonna arm up the drone and give it a nice little rollover. All right guys, so that's about it for today's video. Um, it's really rather simple to set up the turtle mode. It's just kind of confusing. Um, I was having some trouble with it. I hope I was able to help you guys out with, uh, with getting the turtle mode set up on your drones. And hopefully we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.